Hello everyone, this is Chris Rogoza from Geneva Digital Marketing Group providing you digital marketing news. We selected from thousands of articles from different newsletters the best marketing news, the diamonds that we will share with you right now. And today's news are first IAB study shows a return on social media of 3 to 1. Then, getting social at sea with Norwegian Cruise Line. Afterwards, e consultants' insights on digital marketing. And finally, how to gain a reputation as a small business owner. So, let's start with the first one. AAB study shows a return on social media of 3 to 1, based on article from Engage Sciences. So, Internet Advertising Bureau, briefly IAB, has done a study based on which FMCG brands can generate £3.34 for every £1 spent on social media. Their study was based on brands like Heinz or Twinings. Now, this ROI is a lot higher than, for example, for digi different digital marketing tactics like TV, where in Europe right now we are hardly getting one unit back for one unit of money spent. Christine Brief, IAB's Director of Marketing Communications, is commenting this result in the following way. Social media is the only channel where it's possible for brands and consumers to have meaningful two-way conversations, making the strand of connections that much stronger. Moreover, one of the marketing managers at Haynes, Ian McCartney, said, fans of Haynes brands expect to see us regularly in the social channels and work the best to content that's about the product they love. In the case of encouraging trial for a newer product line, frequency becomes even more important to support the new concept. So it seems that we are getting stronger connection with brand via social media. It's a way to harmonize the brands and finally enable the brands to become for us like a friend, like in many multinational companies. Stacke du Norsk? Nay. Well, it's not important whether you speak Norwegian or not, but it's very interesting to hear from Frostmeath.com how Norwegian cruise lines are getting social with their customers. Based on the interview with Marisa Skin, Director of Social Media and Public Relations, we know that cruise like a Norwegian is getting a new meaningful, meaningful way by social media. Marissa Skin stated that they utilize social media to engage current fans, educate fans, and prospective cruisers, attract new cruisers, and spread new announcements and promotional messaging. Now, they have different ways for different social media channels to promote their activity. First of all, Facebook is the way to engage with their customers. They want them to see their posts and they want their customers to wish that they were there on a cruise ship. On the other hand, Twitter is a way to react to all tweets from the customers that they receive and make sure that any concert would be resolved as soon as possible. Norwegian Cruise Lines was the first company as a cruise line to implement Instagram and Pinterest to share a visual imaginary that makes people wish they were on cruise 
and hopefully entices them to start planning. Now, the social media GOA or NCL is to get more fans to engage with them in real time, already from the ship while their customers are cruising, as, as they would do on the land. So they want their customers, when they are checking on the ship, to ready start to post photos, status updates, share any stories that are happening. However, it's quite costly to use social media on a boat. Therefore, NC uh, is investigating ways in which they could offer their guests social connectivity at low cost so that the customers would be more inclined to stay social during their vacation. And now some statistics and insights from income sentences on digital marketing. 22% of marketing emails fail to reach the subscribers' inbox based on the research among UK companies. E-commerce page blow up times are becoming slower. Based on UK search engine marketing benchmark report 2013, more than half of agencies, which is exactly 52%, is now offering a full range of digital marketing services, which has increased as since 2012 from 45% and from 42% since 2011. Now, more statistics on this matter you can find in the chart below, saying that on the second place you can find SEO, then paid search, and finally social media and display advertising. A big rate of companies, 69%, take care of social marketing in-house, while only 7% exclusively use an agency to conduct this job. Google Plus shows strong correlation with high search rankings. When you check the chart, despite right now you will see that afterwards it's Facebook, tweets, Pinterest. It might be combined with the thought of Google that Google Plus and Google search engine are working together, whereas Facebook's posts with or Pinterest post has no big significance for the search engine of Google. Forty three percent of companies are not confident that social media drives are right while 63% of marketers still consider email as the most useful form of digital marketing, based on the research of Tagman. So it seems that email will, is still helpful for digital marketers. And finally, some practical tips for small business owners. How you can gain reputation via digital marketing based on digitalsherpa.com First of all, assess as 97% of consumers do their own review before a purchase you should check with the digital space what others are saying about you what you find in the search engine, what kind of reviews 
do you find? Are people sharing any posts about you on social media or blogs or websites? For this reason, you can use sites like Yelp, Facebook, Twitter, individual blogs, websites, or any other country-specific sites. Then monitor and address your reputation. As 90% of surveys respondents claim that positive online review impacted their purchase decision, make sure that you monitor your reputation all the time within digital and reply to any negative reviews or issues that you would find. Make sure also that you enhance your customer service and address any issues as soon as possible. Finally, build and promote your reputation. Having this strong bears after first and second step, you can move and start to claim and update local listings. Ask your satisfied customers for testimonials. Create a video about that. Share the reviews in a written form. I do hope that after these tips from Digital Sherpa, you will go up to speed with your business. And finally, I would like to invite you for the next event of Geneva Digital Marketing Group on 20th August 2013 in Geneva, where Nicolas Rizos, the former PNG product manager and Nielsen consultant, will present a topic, how to handle social media crisis. This event will take place in Geneva, in Cra and all the details you can find on the sites where the links are on the bottom of this slide. So thank you very much for your attention in this first part of digital marketing news. More will come. We'll again select for you next digital marketing news from the last week. And if you are interested in more digital marketing uh, news or posts, you are more than welcome to visit our sites on Facebook, Twitter or YouTube. Look for Geneva Digital Marketing Group. This was Chris Rogoza from Geneva Digital Marketing Group. Thank you very much for your attention.